Striking back, President Trump threatening tariffs on over $2 billion in French products. This in response to France's new 3% tax on revenue of American tech companies that do business over there. U.S. tariff would hit champagne, cheese, handbags, those expensive ones, makeup, soap, wine, and a lot more, all taxed at a 100% rate above current prices. This affects $2.4 billion in French imports. France saying there will be a strong response if the U.S. follows through. But is there another way to fight back against France's new tech tax other than tariffs? What do you think, John? I certainly think there is, yes. Look, if you do something like this to some companies like Chanel, companies like Hermes are going to get killed. Winemakers are going to get killed. Those businesses have nothing to do with this trade war, with this digital tax, anything that's going on that the president is dealing with. They should not be affected by it. This is where the president should not be dismantling the WTO. This is where the president should help reform the WTO. So, so let me just get a specific, for. let me press you on this. You, you say there is another answer besides tariffs. What is it? Just getting a, an edict from the WTO? Yes, I, I would try to put some teeth with the WTO instead of trying to strip the teeth out of the WTO. I would mm -hmm. have the U.S. try to reform the WTO and then go to them with disputes like this because WTO has ruled in favor of the U.S. in many of these cases. Yeah, you know, I hate tariffs. They're taxes. They do not encourage prosperity. They take money out of the hands of the consumer. The funny thing is, if you think about these digital taxes in France, it probably ends up hurting their consumers because oh, our yeah. tech companies are savvy and they're going to just pass it along. So the way that I would do it is I would, as the U.S. government, work with our tech companies to let the French people know and encourage right. them to get, have a backlash against their own government saying, why are you taxing us? Why are you making things more expensive yeah, yeah. for <laughs> us? Instead of bringing the American people into the fray. Yeah, but Carol, you know, if you listen to the president's words today, he's not against taxes. He's not against taxing big taxes. It's just that he wants to do the taxing. He thinks that <laughs> he has the right. I mean, and that's the problem here. I mean, uh, you know, this whole idea of, of taxing now imports on cheese, on wine, or whatever, who pays those taxes? Americans. That's what's so disheartening that the president's response to unfair taxes in France is to levy taxes now on Americans on things that, you yeah. know, they want to buy. Maybe so what would you do, it. Jonathan, to stop freedom. this tech tax? D David, the answer is freedom. Make the U.S. the freedom center that beckons all businesses. And look, does anyone really want to be like France? They've had 10% unemployment for decades since the socialists came to power and no real innovation, no technology. By, by the, so, by the so way, so I have freedom in America. Only... That's all you need. I'm the only one with a solution, so Christina, help me out. Let the women win this one. Well, I'm actually going to take I'll put it in the WTO. Guys, 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 may I chime well. in? Just, the solution. United States has somewhat of an argument given this digital 3% tax is exempting French firms. They have a corporate yep. tax that uh, benefits those that are domiciled in France. So I do understand the argument that the United States is going forth. And I don't understand why France is moving ahead of first mover advantage by without getting any of the European countries behind it, not even waiting for the OECD that said that they were going to, you know, move forward in 2020 with a plan. So France is kind of uh, stinging themselves in the butt by yeah. doing this. They're, the United States is going to make more money off of all of these tariffs versus what France is going to make off of the tax. And maybe we can all switch to Valveda. Valveda?